So less than a day after the Pirates hopefully kicked off the trade season, they are back at it again, albeit in a smaller trade. In this video, I will explain and break down this trade and what it means for both teams, as well as the Pirates potentially fleecing the Yankees. Heading to the Yankees and the player with the most big league experience is reliever Clay Holmes. This season, the 28-year-old reliever had a 4.93 earned run average in 42 innings for the Pirates. While his fielding independent pitching, which is 406, suggests that he's been better than what his earned run average has indicated, this is not the reliever you would think the Yankees would acquire in the middle of a playoff race where their bullpen has struggled. But if he can lower his walk rates, then Holmes could be a solid reliever. Heading to the Pirates are infield prospects Diego Castillo and Hoi Jung Park. While both of them are not top prospects, both are solid additions to the Pirates' farm system. This season in AAA, Park has been unstoppable, hitting 307 with 11 home runs and three more walks than he has strikeouts. His solid play earned him a promotion to the big leagues, but he received only one at bat before being sent down. Given that he is only 25 years old, Park could fit into the Pirates' future roster, and he looks like he could at least be a utility man at the big league level. Also heading back to the Pirates is 23-year-old infielder Diego Castillo. In double-A ball this season, Castillo was hitting 277 with 11 home runs and an 850 OPS. While he's not regarded as highly as Park, Castillo is a solid piece in this trade. For the Pirates, this is a very good return as they trade a reliever who has almost a 5 earned run average in exchange for two intriguing infield prospects. Park has been tearing up AAA and deserves a longer look at the big league level, while Castillo has been putting up very solid numbers in AA. Even if they don't both pan out, it is at least a solid trade for an average reliever. If you guys have enjoyed this video, then please like and subscribe and tell me what you think of this trade in the comments section below. Thanks for watching!